today we're gonna move on to the handrails for the stairs. We're gonna incrementally go up and grit to sand down these handrails. First I started with the flat surfaces, then I carefully rounded out the corners. Then I cut the angled rail to fit in between the two knoll posts. Yeah, this is awesome. Next, I used some mineral spirits to clean up any of the residue from the sanding or cutting. Next, it was time for polyurethane, which I was a little nervous about because you can get those bubbles if you're not careful. I went with a water-based poly simply because it's easier to work with. Always apply poly in one direction following the grain of the wood. I found it easier to work in sections and blend as I went. When working with poly, patience is key to achieve that nice smooth finish. It's better to apply several thin layers rather than one or two thick layers. When working with water-based poly, it's fairly common to get a raised grain, especially after the first coat. Gently hand sand in between coats using a very fine grit sandpaper. I'm talking 220 or above. Then wipe it down with a tack cloth before applying the next layer. Make sure that your poly has fully dried before sanding and applying the next coat. I ended up doing about five coats of poly to make sure that it had a nice strong finish since these handrails are gonna see a lot of wear and tear. 